I've been in a bit of a funk the last few days, mostly struggling with my physical health, which usually affects my mental state. But it's not just like a cold or a stomach ache. I have various health problems that I'm always trying to tend to, and sometimes they get the best of me. I know these feelings very well though, and I know they'll pass. I've gotten pretty comfortable with being out in the middle of nowhere with very little, but when you're not feeling your best physically, all you want is a comfortable place that you can maybe stand up in with a proper bathroom and just not be so exposed to the elements. Although I wanted to just stay in bed this whole day, it's important for me to push myself out. There's quite a few things I have to try and center myself again, but movement and creation are the top ones that I always turn to. I woke up at 6.30 a.m. this day, and I didn't have a particular concept for a video. But I just said to myself, I'm going to film this whole day and see what comes of it. The weather obviously wasn't very nice, and this video might even seem a bit boring at times, but I really enjoyed filming it, and it certainly got me out of my funk. I've been struggling with food and flare-ups lately, but I love to cook and I still try to make a little something when I can. I'm really in tune with my body, maybe a little too much at times where it becomes a bit obsessive, but I just always want to feel my best, especially living on the road. And when no one else seems to understand what I'm going through, there's always one person who does. Hello. Hello. Hi. Sorry. What was going on? Sorry. No, I'm fine. Yeah, I'm gonna go for a walk now. Okay. Okay. All right. Love you. Bye. Bye. Love you. Bye. Even when I'm feeling down, I feel so fortunate to be so close to nature. 
I love going on walks multiple times a day and just observing everything around me. Spending time in nature always centers me again. Oh yeah, and I can also dance like an idiot without anyone judging me. I usually try to start my work day earlier, but you gotta take care of the body and clean the space before you can do good work, right? Or where were you looking, Bini? No, you were looking at Amazon. Amazon, yeah. Okay. I just want to see what my options might be. A typical workday consists of posting on social media accounts, emailing brands to work with, editing photos or video, and of course getting a handful of rejection emails from brands I really wanted to work with. But that's kind of just how it is, and I keep trying. Of course, I can't feel too down around good company. Mm. Okay. <laughs> oh. Hello. This is my life. <laughs> Every fucking day. Oh, I've had lots Ooh. of mangoes. Okay, well, you should have these ones. Make yourself at home. You guys just ganging up on me like usual. It's okay. Let's do it. <laughs> I don't think we do that as much. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are gaslighting me into thinking that you're not bullying. <laughs> okay, but actually though. <laughs> no, no. Dude, you gotta go. <laughs> it's totally. My time in Arizona is slowly coming to an end. It feels really bittersweet. I got here late January and was only planning to be here maybe two weeks. And here it is, almost two months later. I didn't expect to find this much or make the friends that I did. Life on the road is full of little surprises like that. Sometimes it feels hard to leave a place, but there's always something just as good around the corner. I have an idea of where I'm headed next, but I'm not quite sure when. When it's time to go, I'll know.